but yeah, uh, Sarah Silverman and Nick Kroll were, were hilarious as always. Just the usual stories, you know, hanging out with comedians, one at a diner and uh, went to the park. And I think we think we all know how that goes, especially if uh, you are anywhere where there's homeless people or stragglers uh, who hang oh, out in, yeah. in your nearby parks. <laughs> yeah, for sure. That was a, that was a, that was a crazy story. I couldn't believe that. I was yeah. <laughs> so they, then they were all touching each other's faces. It's like, holy shit. Are they, were they just hippies though? Or were they actual like Groves homeless people? that they just yeah. met because you know they were hanging out with just hippies yeah it's well who knows like they could have it they were in la at the time so they could have like yeah. ran down to skid row but as far as i know like the comedy clubs are around hollywood and different places so they probably weren't like too close to the the homeless homeless but like it may, maybe they were around uh, some folks in the park in venice beach it was probably the same thing yeah but let's be honest <laughs> Other than in the <laughs> 60s and 70s, and even then, like... Yeah, for sure. How can, can you really be a hippie and own a home or rent? Like, Yeah. <laughs> if you live in your van, I guess so. are you... I, guess are, so. I, I wouldn't consider you homeless, but... I mean, Sarah Silverman might. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> let's, let's be honest. They just uh, totally bail. They just... <laughs> yeah exactly exactly ruin the whole fucking vibe yeah yeah people with the yeah. fucking prettiest faces you're up next to feel run run out of the park <laughs> yeah yeah free great out yeah. and make the biggest mistake you can make high on hallucinogens try and drive <laughs> oh yeah classic classic <laughs> <laughs>